Are you close with your mom now? Me and my mom's are super cool, um, but my pops is like my, my, my best friend, so you see him a lot with me, but I got a lot of love and admiration for my mom. She busted her butt to get me where I'm at numerous times. She was working, she had a full-time job at this dollar rental car place, and she had a part-time job, then at night, I remember she used to pack up like uh, necklaces. Okay. Like she'd make necklaces all night long, and I would wake up like at two in the morning as a kid and see her working. I'd be like, man, she just left to work, came back from work, and it's still working right now to make ends meet. And those type of visuals install the work ethic that you could go to the greatest gym in the world, American Top Team, and ask any of the coaches there who's got the best work ethic or one of the best work ethics, and they'll tell you that's me, man. I don't, I don't, I don't pull that knee off because I'm just so talented. No, I, I rep that knee more than any human being walking this earth. I'm in there every day, getting after my repetitions, my running, my sprints, my swimming, whatever it is that I got to do. I'm out working everybody in that room, and a big part of that is because of my mother. The work ethic that I saw that she had was insane to me, you know. And, and I was at a young age, and this impacted me, you know. So that's how that's how strong of a work ethic that immigrant mentality they say now it's like trendy to say, but it, it's true, you know. She came over with a work drive, and then when my dad went away, she had to turn it up even more, you know.